In this video, we will discuss one shot timer. The one shot timer keeps the output on for a set period of time. Okay. Even if the input for the timer remains on, the output is turned off after a set period of time. This is the main difference between one shot timer and off delay timer. The logic is almost same both one shot timer and off delay timer with small changes. So go to the software. So this is the logic which we discussed for off delay timer, right? Now we will create one shot timer. The first rung is for off delay timer. Now we will create one shot timer logic. So take one rising edge input. We have to take rising edge. Take push button two which is x21 this is push button 2 x21 is address click ok and take one output i am using this lamp y20 so enter y20 again latch the output so take one envo content sorry cancel it we have to go for branch enter output y20 click ok again take one branch here for output take vertical line select here and then take on output timer i will take t1 space k and out delay enter 30 3 second delay ok now you have to insert one nc contact of timer here this nc contact of timer is required to unlatch the output whenever it activates enter timer t1 ok logic is completed so convert and download Remember, only this rung 8 is for one shot timer. This rung 0 is for off delay timer. So, we will simulate the logic here. If I activate input push button 2, what happens? Output is turned on for some time and again turned off. Say, for example, if I give an input again x21 continuously what happens nothing happened right timer is continually continues its operation and uh, output is turned off this is the difference main difference between one shot timer and off delay timer if you see i'm activating the off delay timer x20 input timer started again and again and again i'm giving many inputs repeatedly what is happening output is continuously on at the same time timer is not at all started it is always reset from zero right so this is the difference between half delay timer and one shot timer as it is a rising gauge when our input change from zero to one one time the timer automatically will start and output will be latched as there is no nc content of input in the timer run or sorry timer instruction with timer is not going to stop there is no one to stop the timer so timer will continuously run irrespective of the input output is on again output is off after time three seconds here in this case so for better understanding I will remove the off delay timer. Delete line. Delete line. Right to PLC. So this is the logic for one shot timer. Activate push button to timer started and the output will be turned off after some time. 
depending on our requirement in the ladder logic programming we can use either off delay timer or one shot timer it's purely depends on the application if you want to turn off an output after a certain time you can go for off delay timer if you want to turn on an output on for one time you can go with one shot timer i will meet you in the next session